Hey peeps, welcome to the Crafty Bits UK. My name is Arietta. Uh, today I've got a bit of a Stitchy Witch unboxing for you, um, but it's completely new company to me, something I've not tried before. Um, so I hope that you will enjoy the little unboxing and come along on this new skill journey with me. So we'll waste no time, we'll get straight into it. Um, it came in this envelope, I have removed my address. This came up from Rowan Dean Embroidery. And this is their Poppies and Daisies kit. So, this is what it will hopefully look like when it's finished. <laughs> so, um, it's kind of a very, by the looks of it, from the tiny bit of research I've done, it's a very sort of freehand embroidery art form. Um, yeah, so this says embroidery kits designed by Wilma Shields and Katrina Witten. This is Poppies and Daisies 1241 in the Rowandine Embroidery Miniatures series. So this should come with everything I need. We'll get this out and see. I am a little bit nervous. <laughs> okay, so I've got a little card showing us what we're going to be making. It looks so pretty. And we've then got uh, these are little bugle beads, lovely twisty ones. I like those. We've got fabrics, so we've got the red, we've got these sort of royal fabrics in different shades of blue and oh, yellow and green and another green and then we've got this is our actual material which is a very nice soft canvas question mark so you can see Got a little bit of the pattern marked out on it um, but it's very open to interpretation we've got oh, many threads including is that needles I bet that's needles yes yeah, so we've got a very very skinny needle and a slightly larger needle. I've got some lovely different flosses here, some sort of different textures. We've got a sparkly one in there. Um, these are on numbered card. And then this is our instructions. So beginner's tips. So it's organza, not royal. Organza uh, tells us what stitches to do, how to cut out little circles for the for the poppies, um, and to go to their YouTube channel, which I will link that down below here, so that you can go and check out their YouTube channel to have a look as well. And then they've got their web address there, so it's just rowandine.com. So yeah, this is just another little, you something a bit different. I feel like it's going to be quite forgiving. Um, and it's, I felt like with the layering of the materials, it was a bit like painting with fabric, maybe. Um, but yeah, I sort of liked, I liked the painterly qualities of it. So I thought I would give it a go. Um, I don't think it'll take too long, but I don't want to rush it. Um, and for that reason as well, this is not a project I'm gonna undertake on a live or anything, just because um, my eyesight's not good enough to be honest to be doing <laughs> distance sewing. I quite like to get like, way up in there and <laughs> see what I'm doing so I will of course I'll share some progress pictures as I work on it and um we'll do a bit of a post review once it's finished 
but yeah so i just thought it was a bit of fun um there's lots of other designs available from them do go and check them out they are a uk company they are based in derby um and yeah this was not i don't think this was too expensive considering you know how many different bits they have to put together and the fact that it's a small business um so this was 13.95 for the kit and then i paid 175 postage so um i'm not sure about overseas shipping um you would have to pop onto their website and have a look but obviously it ships in an envelope so maybe i shouldn't imagine it would be too expensive to post these sorts of things overseas but again do go and check out their website and find out um this is not a sponsored item or um pr this is something that i bought for myself um and yeah i i'm interested in getting started with it um my wedding anniversary is at the end of august and our wedding theme it's been 15 years now our wedding theme was poppies and corn um so this will be a nice thing to work on in that kind of weird end of summer <laughs> sort of phase that we're in at the moment i think it'd be quite a nice little thing to sit and do so wish me luck <laughs> and um, i will see you in another video when i have finished this so that is all for me for today do go check out the links down below um as always huge thanks to those of you that support me on this channel through patreon or youtube memberships that's so so kind of you and i really do appreciate it of course those of you that are unable to do that you can always support the channel for free by liking sharing subscribing commenting down below and pop on over to facebook become a member of the crafty coven over there and share your own creative items so that's all from me for today until next time stay crafty